Cataract surgery is a minimally invasive procedure that usually takes less than one hour to perform. Prior to the start of the procedure, a local anesthetic is used to numb the eye. A small incision is made in the cornea, and the lens capsule is then opened so that the surgeon can extract the cataract. A probe is inserted into the capsule to break up the cataract using ultrasound, and the cataract is removed from the eye. After the cataract is removed from the capsule, an intraocular lens is inserted in the capsule and remains in place, restoring natural vision. If you have mild to moderate open angle glaucoma and are currently taking one to three anti-glaucoma medications, you may want to consider enrolling in a study of an investigational device to lower pressure in your eye. High pressure in the eye is a symptom of glaucoma. Your enrollment in this study may allow you to receive an investigational device that is implanted in your eye, which is designed to reduce eye pressure in patients with your condition. It does this by creating a channel to allow fluid to drain from the eye. This investigational device is called the eye stent and was created by Glaucos Corporation. It is intended for use in patients undergoing cataract surgery who also have mild to moderate open angle glaucoma. The eye stent is made of titanium, is about a half of a millimeter in length, and is a third of a millimeter in diameter. The eye stent is the smallest device in the world to be implanted in humans and is approximately 25,000 times smaller than the most common devices used to lower pressure in the eye. The eye stent may lower pressure in your eye and may reduce your need for additional surgery or use of medications. The eye stent implantation procedure is straightforward and minimally invasive. After your cataract procedure, a gel is injected in the front part of your eye and an eye drop is added to make your pupil smaller. The eye stent device is inserted through the same incision that was used to perform your cataract surgery. A lens is then placed on your cornea so your doctor can see inside your eye. Two eye stent devices are then injected in the meshwork of your eye to create channels to allow fluid to drain from your eye. The goal of this procedure is to restore the natural outflow of fluid from your eye. 